Hello and welcome to the uh, training tutorial video for the Tribe to Tribe Challenge for Administrators. Uh, I just want to take this time to, to kind of point uh, admins to some some key areas that, that you may have to, to toggle and interact with. Um, what I want to start out by pointing out is there's a switch to you user view toggle button so if you're an admin that's also participating in the challenge uh, you would select this switch to user view um, select your your name and then that's how you would enter uh, your own individual data I'm gonna switch back to the admin view and and just draw your attention to a couple things first of all down here in the activities this is the area that um, you know I, I can change the um, various options for for each individual category big thing is here is that if you go in and, and want to peek at some of this stuff to see what it's all about that's great just avoid this save button down here in the lower right and use the X in the top right so that we're not saving changes um, as, as we're moving throughout the competition over here on the right hand side is, is a list of all the, the participant names and um, a couple of different ways that you can add participants. Uh, you can hit the, the plus and then it, you can generate the, the invitation link and if you hit um, the info it'll kind of give you an idea what, what's going on there. But um, These are the two links. There's the, the group page link, the T2T, as well as the, the longer uh, version of that, that URL. If you need to create an account for somebody that, that does not have internet access, uh, again, you'll use the plus arrow, you'll come up to this, this pop-up window, and you'll create an individual member account. And do that the same way um, that, that you logged in. You would enter the, the person's first name, their last name, if they have a valid email address, use it. Otherwise, you can always come up with um, a bunk email. And then I can add and continue. Uh, member added. And so then if I go down here, I can see um, the uh, where I've created that um, demo individual and so then when I go to switch user view I would then select um, that demo and then I would be able to manually enter in data for that particular individual again going back to switch to admin view um, so that's again how you add somebody that, that you're going to be logging for as an admin up here at the top um, there you can edit again go in and, and, and see a breakdown of some various options with the challenge again don't hit save click the click the X um, and get out of there there is some um, uh, reporting options and this is what we'll use probably at the end um, where we can we can uh, create a, a report in Excel and, and be able to get some data um, you can see individual participant data here uh, as well so there's some some different reporting options as admins up here in the in the how to sections there's a lot of different documents that you can uh, access to answer questions for your uh, participants probably the the user quick start PDF is is probably um, the go-to document as far as answering questions about um, starting out and signing in as well as um, fitness tracker uh, data and how that's um, entered into or, or captured by the challenge runner system and challenge runner uh, communicates with the the tracking device website not directly with the fitness tracker other than that I don't really s know of any other um, Major things that I want to point out here, uh, if if any of the the, um, the tribal admins are, are running into glitches or problems, please reach out, and uh, I'll be glad to uh, to troubleshoot that with you. So, let's have fun with it, and uh, thanks so much for for joining.